Hi everyone, Fairy Nora Cosplay here and I'm back again with another video for you. I know, it's been forever, I am so bad at keeping up with videos, I apologise. But today we're going to be reviewing a costume I bought from My Costumes, Me Costumes, I don't know how you say it, it's got two C's, it's stupid. But I'm, I bought a costume a couple weeks back after wanting it for absolute years and I'm going to review it for you today to see if any of you would want it because I know most of my followers fandom here come from the ruby fandom and it is a ruby costume i mean what else would it be this is me have you got my ruby shirt on see penny's here she's come back ready but it's a ruby costume and i know some people here have wanted to buy it so here's my review for you on the costume that i bought Ooh, suspense surprise so without further ado let's get on and do the review Woo! yay so ooh. Here it is, in the bag that it came in, in the mail. It took way less time than I anticipated. It said it should be here on the 30th of August, and it came two days ago. I don't know what day we're on today. I don't know when I looked at my watch. I don't have a watch. It doesn't say days. But I don't know what day we're on today, whatever day it is. It came early. Let's just put it that way. So it came night... I've already undone it, so... <laughs> Everything's falling out. But it came nicely packaged in this big bag, see, it says, says my costumes on it. How do you say that? I want to know. Is it me costumes, my costumes? Someone tell me in the comments, please tell me how you say it. I'm stupid, apparently. But it came in this nice bag, there's also all the accessories here. And we're going to take it out. So the costume I bought was Volume 4 Cinder, because it was on a Members Day sale. I've never been able to afford it because it's 50 odd quid, I think. So that's one thing to consider if you're going to buy it. It's 50 something pounds. It's currently 30 quid in the sale though, so I can justify that. Yeah, 30 quid's justifiable for a fancy costume. So here is the actual costume. It's in its own little costume bag effort creation. Whatever, I don't know. I got mine in a size large, by the way. If you're taller than me, I don't recommend it because it doesn't come near my feet because I'm quite tall. But it fits perfectly well. You've got to make sure to measure yourself on the size chart if you're going to buy from companies that come from China because they're smaller than us and they never get the sizes right. Please measure yourself. Don't make the mistakes I do. So the, this is the dress. Comes with the tag on it and everything. Tells you how to wash it and stuff. Important. Wash your costumes, people. Don't leave them. Don't get let them get grotty. But this is the Cinder costume. It is. It's velvet, I believe, or fake velvet. I can't remember what fake velvet's called. I have my Sienna capes the same thing. I can't remember what it's called. But it's nice velvet material and it's trimmed with fancy, fancy gold. It's like pleather. I think it's pleather. It's definitely pleather. But this is the dress. It comes with everything you'd imagine it's got a hidden zip in the back so you can't see we like hidden zips the iron on transfers on the sleeves here and on the other sleeve some of the iron on transfers at the top are cracking already don't know if you can see that Put it closer to the camera they are cracking at the top so that's one thing that i would warn everyone to be aware of that you might end up having to replace the transfers at some point but aside from the, that, the dress is very nice quality. It's leather, it's got a nice lining that's not itchy. The so all the all the seams are perfectly well done. It's not dodgy as I've seen from other costumes from other companies, so that's not bad. So this is the dress itself. It's got a slit up the side, I think, somewhere. There you go. Let's do some leg bombing in Cinder. And then there's also a whole bag three bags three bags here of accessories for the costume now you might not know what volume 4 cinder looks like well here it is this this is volume 4 cinder and what she should look like so you'll know she has weird on her legs and a feather and stuff so they're all in here you have to put them on which is sort of annoying i sort of assumed they'd be on the dress itself but i guess it can't be on the dress because you wouldn't get it on. I don't know. But here are the 
Here are the uh, the strappy straps for the legs. They come with safety pins on the back to stick it to the side of the dress. It'd be like stuck to the side. Don't know. My camera's gone up. Stop being stupid, camera. Fixed it. Yeah, these would go on the side of the the slit thing. You put them on. Uh, they're, they're rope and more pleather. They like pleather, clearly. These ones, the the ends are kind of grim. They like stuck together ends. As you can see, they're just sort of stuck. They're not really cut off or anything. It would have been probably better if they'd have glued them. So that's a, a down point I will put on this costume. But aside from that, the buttons are really nice. They're sewn on well. Nice to be like nice buttons. They're all shiny. There's no marks to the pleather, so cool. That's cool. There is three of these. No, two of these. There's two of these. These bits, and then there's two. These. They don't have anything on them. I don't know where they go or what they're for. I don't know if they're spares. They're just there. I'm sure we'll figure it out when I put it on and we look at it. Cool. Yay. Go away. We don't want you anymore. Whoops. They're everywhere now. But yeah, this is that part also. There is also in here somewhere. Big feather. We like big feathers. I like big feathers at any rate. They're fancy. I like costumes with feathers on them. They're cool. And in this one we have oh this is this is very nice the bit that goes on the top of her little side bit top of the slit this also comes with a safety pin so you can pin it onto your dress as you wish for there's a few loose threads on it but i mean that's to be expected with something like feathers it's all it's more pleather and it's also gems i think than plasticky plastic gemmy things you could always change them if you wanted to, but I think it looks quite nice. The feathers could be a little cooler, but it's on the back. You can't see it. It doesn't matter. The back's sort of weird, but the front looks nice, and that's what matters. Fronts matter. Yeah. Woo. But the front, the feathers look nice. Like I said, they clip onto the bit down there somewhere on the side to look fancy, because Cinder is a fancy lady. As evil as she might be, she's a fancy, fancy lady. So that's the feathery nonsense. Cool. And finally we have one last bag of accessories here. I believe this is the glove. I'd assume. Oh, what's this? Cool. So in here is her glove. Also pleather. More pleather. They really like pleather apparently. More gold pleather. But it looks nice, and it's got these two straps on it, which they go around your arms, and then it fastens on your arms, and this bit doesn't come down. Which I think is quite a nice invention. Otherwise, you just sell a tape it to your body, and that's really uncomfortable, so... This is the glove. The glovey boy. One glovey boy. It's all nicely sewn, there's nothing wrong with it. It looks... to character. Probably won't fit me, because I've got fat arms, but... We'll find out later. But this very nice extra part there and it also comes with cinder's mask her weird eye mask thing i've not really figured out which way it goes yet i think, I think it's this i think it's this side uh, someone tell me what side cinder's eye is please i'm assuming it's this side and it has this but it also has these two separate ribbons so i'm guessing you put there's a hole here hole i'm guessing you put these through the hole and then just tie it to that and tie it around your head but who knows it's sort of scratched on the back, as you can see, the paint job's not the best, so you'd probably want to fix that, but it's on the back, no one really cares. But the front looks cool. We like things that look cool. I remind myself of the Phantom of the Opera right now. It's a very good musical, watch it. But yes, this is the mask also. And finally, I've just lost it. I didn't think it would come with this, but it does. It comes with an earring for her one side, because Cinder only has one earring because she's weird. It's one of those weird, these ones, the twisty twisty ones, you twist it up, you shove your ear through it and you screw it back down. It's like you're screwing an ear, but it's fake, obviously. 
because I don't have ear piercings, so these are good for me. But it looks nice, can't complain. It's a nice solid gem, it's not scratched. It's not falling apart yet, so... Bonus! I've had these that have fallen apart in like two seconds when I've picked them out the bag, so... We like things that don't fall apart. But yes, that is the costume as it comes out of the bag, so I'm going to put it on and you can see the whole thing on and it'll look nice, hopefully. So in three, two, one. And here I am back again, me in the costume. Here it is, so the neck, in my opinion, is a bit tight, so I don't have it done all the way up now because it's a bit tight and I don't want to get strangled. I've also still got this on, so it's probably the reason. Who knows? I just don't want to die. The gloves, as I said, they're not big enough for me. They never are. My arms are really long. I'm a disproportionate person and nothing ever fits properly. I haven't done the thing up because I, I can't. I, I need help. I'm stupid. I, I need help to do these things. But it's on. It looks cool. I've not really figured out the side bits. I'll move over here and show you in a minute. But I don't think I have them on right. I've still got those extra pieces don't know what the, they do i uh, don't think i'll ever know what they do but i'll figure it out i haven't got the mask on or the earring because i'm lazy here you go here's the mask <laughs> that's, that's all you're getting for now i think it's upside down is it this way no it has to be that way yeah whatever <laughs> anyway we're gonna stand up we're gonna show you the whole thing we're gonna go this way i don't know if it's gonna do anything no yes maybe how far back do I stand? We'll stand here, cool, works. So this is the costume itself. See, I haven't really figured out these weird strappy bits yet, but it's what it is. It fits me perfectly. It's a bit too short, but everything's too short on me. I hate this angle. We're, we're redoing this. Cinder herself with her weird floppy sleeves. The gloves, they should be up here, but I haven't put them down. Yeah, I haven't really figured this whole set up out but i'll figure it out it'll be something but this is cinder herself the whole costume when it's on it's really nice you there's not really any flaws in my opinion when it's on it looks nice it's comfortable aside from this but i have weird arms so it's gonna be uncomfortable this is fun you could hide a child in your sleeve or other things maybe not a child don't do that as kidnapping but you can hide things in your sleeves put snacks in it who knows but this is the thing, whole thing. Looks nice, very fancy. So yeah, woo! Back over here, we're, we're moving again. But yeah, there we go, back again. So... <coughs> Camera won't play with me. Hmm. It's not working, it's out. Right, so I'm going to go to the end now and you can hear my whole review on this. So in three, two, one. And I'm back again to conclude the review. So, you've seen the costume on, you've heard my opinion on it. Well, my opinion overall on the dress, I give it a solid 4.5 out of 5. I really like it, it's nice material, it's well made. Yes, there's a few straggly bits elsewhere, there's a few loose threads and the weird bit on this, the, the weird bit I didn't like on the end of this thing who knows ah i'm attacking myself but all in all i think it's very nice very well made and i'm going to enjoy wearing it a lot because it fits me perfectly it's my exact size they got everything right the shipping was fast the company was nice the price was reasonable to me at any rate i don't spend that much money on them so the price was reasonable good customer service they even give me a tracking number other companies don't give me tracking numbers for shipping, so I'm not mad. I'm only mad at Hermes who delivered it, but I don't like Hermes, and that's for another day. Hermes are a really bad company. Don't shop with Hermes, please. <laughs> but yes, this was my review on the My Costumes Volume 4. It is Volume 4, isn't it? Yeah. Volume 4 Cinder Dress Accessories thing. Costume, woo, yeah. But anyway, thank you for being here and watching this and continuing to support me even when I do stupid rambly things like this. But thank you and I will see you all in the next video, whenever that might be, in nine years time because I never make videos. Bye bye!